the ID non-identical foods 11D. For this program, you're just going to need pictures of food or food items. For train stimuli, we used green apples, red grapes, a plain hot dog, a whole pizza. And then for test stimuli, we did a red apple, bunches of grapes, a hot dog with toppings instead of just a plain one, and a pizza slice instead of a whole pizza. So it just kind of shows you a variation of how you could do this. So for your train class, you're going to want to pick those basics, and then for your test class, make them a little more complex with a bunch, some extra toppings, something that looks a little bit different than that. Um, you could do different variations of tacos for train and test. Um, you know, bunches of oranges with orange slices different burgers with toppings and things that might look different. And then here's maybe another variation of the burger. So just whatever kind of works for you as far as making those look a little bit different for train and then for test. And then it's just very simple. You're just going to present the pictures, either train class field or test class field, and ask, find whatever the food is. Um, so that's just a quick material sample for peak generalization, receptively ID non-identical foods, 11D.